shortly after rationalisation, uh, regulations came about. Um, and I've put 1967, actually, there's no specific date, but I've just given you a rough estimate. So during this time, what happened is the influence of the public schools created a general trend towards the regulations of how sports were played, and they begin to began to codify the sports. Um, the process is called codification. Okay. For example, what they did is they adopted uh, the Queensbury Rule in boxing uh, in 1867. And also what happened is sports associations and leagues began to form. So where we got factory workers, they would form their own football team. So in 1886, uh, Arsenal was formed by the wor workers from the Woolwich Ar Arsenal factory. Um, development in sport during this period gave much more structure and fabric to the sport, laying down the modern foundation. So we had this structure, we had these leagues, we had these re regulations that surrounded surrounded sport. City councils also played an active role in providing sport venues for their communities, trying to get people engaged in sport. So providing that space and that uh, area for people to go and play would encourage people to, to get involved and codify it. The beginnings of professionalism were laid down too um, and the Olympic Games were reintroduced in 1896. Okay, so there's lots of dates there that you can put in your timeline, um, but you need to be able to explain what the regulations of sport and what that era looked like.